Welcome to this quick demonstration of laying out a form using Form Maker. And we'll start off by adding a new form and we'll call it just test. Now you can see the format of the first page in the form it can be grid, table list, or freestyle. And we'll just leave it at grid for the time being. Freestyle pages is more flexible and more powerful, and grid is easier to use. So we'll just use grid. Go into design, and here's our grid page and it's empty at the moment so to add an edit box there we go we'll just drag it across like that if we want to add another one I can drag it like that and uh, if we wanted it to add say a segmented control drag it on like that and say another segmented control and then perhaps maybe a notepad field like that so it's very easy just to drag on controls and they just list down the screen now one of the advantages of having it uh, in a grid like this is that if we wanted to change the number of columns we could change it like that so that's now in a two column format and that looks quite nice so let's finish off by just adding a picker field on the end there and uh, and that's basically all there is to laying out a form if I want to move some of these around I can click on a field and then nudge it and this time I'll nudge it to the right and you can see it swaps those two fields over. So that's laying out a form in a grid style with Form Maker.